Hi there. Um, hopefully we've got sand this time. Um, do you ever sort of take a remark from someone and suddenly think, oh my goodness, did, did, did I do something to upset them? Or maybe someone sort of gave you a look or did well, whatever it is or made a comment and, and you sort of immediately take it on board that for whatever reason their um, approach to you is your fault, their negativity. Um, well, if that's the case, hopefully this quote will help you. Um, my name is Kai Graham and my company is The Mind Model and every day I um, sort of release an inspirational quote and give you my spin on it. And today's quote is, how people treat you is all about them and nothing about you. Um, and I think that's fair enough. Um, what we tend to do, I, I've seen quite a lot of it just recently actually, it's, you know, a, a number of my sort of friends and colleagues have sort of said, oh God, I don't know what I did and so-and-so got really shirty and I didn't mean it that way or, you know, I don't understand. And it, it um, reminded me of a situation um, with my darling husband, I hope he doesn't mind me saying this. Um, and he came back, I think he was on a cycle ride, and he came back and was very monosyllabic and not really his usual self. And I sort of thought, oh my God, what have I done? Is the house a mess? No, it's not. Have I done something wrong? What did I say? And I ran through my head all the different things that, you know, well, why wasn't he as being his usual sparkly self? And he just went into his sort of, um, you know, man cave I guess and just sort of sat and sort of ostracized himself and I was racking my brains and couldn't work out what was going on and then about three hours later he came out and gave me a kiss and disappeared I said hang on a where, where are you going to he said I've just found out how I can fix my bike chain <laughs> so there was me fretting and worrying and all this sort of stuff and actually his silence and his sort of issues were nothing about me at all and so it just goes to show that we can overanalyze stuff sometimes. Um, and, you know, someone's comment to us could be an off-the-cuff remark that we take personally and it's absolutely nothing to do with us. Um, and then there was another time my darling boy Jack was, he was in P1, um, and he, so he was about four or five, um, and he was getting bullied. And it was only when I explained to him and I said to him, this fellow that's bullying you is actually sad inside himself. And then Jack was able to work it out for himself that actually this, the way this chap was treating him had nothing to do with Jack at all. It was about what was going on in this other little fellow's life. So it just, you know, it's, let's just say it doesn't always revolve around us. It's not all about us all the time. And it's just sometimes worth remembering that. Um, because other people's stuff affects them and okay we might bear the brunt of it but it's not necessarily our fault but also have a think and think what's going on in your life and maybe you are just maybe being short with someone or maybe you're just not treating people as you should because there's too much going on with you so just have a think about it um, but remember that it's not really your, um, it's not always your responsibility, your fault or whatever to on how other people react with you and how other people treat you. So just as long as you're being nice and as long as you're being kind and, and you've got the right intentions, then just let other people get on with their stuff um, and it should all line itself out. Um, that said, uh, thank you for the shares. Thank you for the comments, loving them. Um, it, it's just really, it just helps me realise that I'm sort of, you know, doing something okay. Um, I'm home now, back from London, so um, out of my little bubble and back to the real world again. Um, well, actually, not for a couple of hours, because later on I'm going to turn the telly on and watch Liverpool. So with any luck, we'll do all right tonight. Um, so good luck, good luck to the Reds, and um, I shall hopes, hopefully have a good day, good evening, and I shall chat to you tomorrow. Thanks very much indeed. Bye-bye.